Oh, wow. I didn't even think the game was that long. The game was that long? Jesus. The game was like just 100 moves. The other game was like 180 moves. Okay, but I had a pawn, you know? I had a pawn. I'm trash. Patrick Van Paul, can you please write your chess.com username in the chat? Uh, I will not be responding to you until you do that, thanks. I don't know what I thought I was getting out of the move bishop g4. Really, I have no idea what I thought this was going to get me. Okay, let's go back. I'm playing completely unnecessarily risky chess right now. Uh, King b8. Let's get out of the pin. I mean, it, it's like I'm just creating imbalance for no reason, kind of. But, okay. Uh, queen f7, or queen c6, or queen b5. I mean, I feel like queen b5 is the right move. But okay, let's play like queen f7. <clears throat> Man, you guys are asking a lot of questions, really, like it's so many questions right now being asked, and amazing. Like just in the middle of, like just the two, you know, I got two minutes on the clock to, you know, find the best moves against some of the best players in the world, and you guys are like, WHY IS YOUR NAME GOTHAM?! Why do I have chess in my name? I don't know. Good question. The idea of this move is to go here, to either open up the position, or force him to block his own bishop. Which I actually think is going to make me really good progress in the position. Because I think after... Wow, that looks insane. Really? Oh my god. Dude looks... My guy deranged, what is he doing? Aren't I just gonna f beat up his... Wow. I am not anticipating any of his moves, like, at all. This is crazy stuff. Uh... Huh. Okay, take, take. Take, take, something like Queen H7? I don't know. I'm tanking, because I just don't understand what he's doing. Yeah, I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take. I guess I'll just double my rooks? I don't know. Queen before? Yes, I know queens can move that long. That move attacks nothing and loses the most important pawn in my position. Thank you very much for the move suggestion. I think he kind of gave me some hope on the H-file. I mean, again, in critical positions, sometimes I just take like 50 seconds of time for like no reason. Yeah, bishop e3 loses a bishop. I mean, it's a very confident move. I don't know how good it is, but it's confident for sure. Let's go rook f8. I'm keeping my options open. Maybe I should have not gone rook f8. Now queen b4 is actually not the stupidest move. Uh, at least before it was. Um, yeah, very tough to say. I mean, sometimes in these positions, I look for, like, a complete solution to my problems. And it just... Oh, bishop d2? Oh, bishop d2 is incredible. Oh, but what a move. Oh, this is incredible, bishop d2. Look at this move. 
Wow. I'm threatening this. If he takes, I take his rook, it's game over. If he takes my rook, I take like this. And I'm threatening queen h2, and his rook is hanging. Oh my god. Maybe bishop e3 was more accurate because I was preventing queen g1, but what I really like is that the rook is hanging. Bishop d2 is an exceptional move. Rook h7, queen h7, queen g1, and then I'm gonna take his rook and I guess I'm gonna try to win the endgame. But my pawn still sucks, which is really annoying. It's gonna, yeah, like, I think he's gonna take, take and play queen g1. Did I have bishop e3? I have a weird feeling bishop e, no. Bishop e3 might have actually been even better because I prevent queen g1. Oh, interesting. This way. Okay. You sure though? I feel like... I feel like this way is worse because now he can't move any pieces and I'm just gonna like, hunt him. Like, I don't know how, but somehow. Queen a5? Like, he just- he can't move anything. I think this way he actually does himself more harm than good. Because now we're just frozen. Like, he can't move anything and I can't move anything and... But I actually have the pressure. Let's go queen b6. Maybe he can play rook b1. No, he can't play rook b1. It's really funny, actually. Actually, hilariously tragic that he can't make any moves. This is very sad for him. I'm gonna just hide my king so it's off the back rank. Okay. Three pawn. What? Okay. Stalls out his clock. Stalls out his clock. Stalls out his clock. Cause he mad he lost to me. Stalls out his clock. Ah, stalls out his clock. I think this is Alex Golden. Yes, he's uh, he's good. I've, I'm, I've played him a lot. Uh, anyway, what was the best move? Was it bishop e3? It was bishop d2! What was the refutation of this move? Ah! So what he played in the game was losing the rook. But you see, th this incredible move attacks the rook and deflects the queen. And the point is that when he takes, I'm gonna go here and add a cannon to the h-file. So this is- why is this plus seven? G5, which is middle games masterclass pawn play chapter. It's my move.